about that. I've decided to call my business the Funky Chicken. One of the factors when deciding how much to supply will be the price. So in other words, how much you can get for a piece of chicken? And would a higher price cause you to supply a higher or a lower quantity? The higher the price, the more profits I'll make, and that will push me to sell more. That's right. So if we denote quantity supplied as QS, we can say that as price, P, increases, so QS increases, and vice versa. Looking back, how does this price-supply relationship differ from the price-demand for fried chicken pieces? Well, in the demand formula, a higher price leads to a drop in quantity demanded. It's a negative or inverse relationship. But with supply, a rise in price leads to a higher quantity supplied, which is a positive relationship. Now, I can hear some of you thinking, Surely you can only supply as much of a product as the public is willing to buy. Well, that's correct, and we'll look more closely at the relationship between supply and demand later. But for now, in order to understand how a supplier makes decisions, we'll focus just on the supply side of the market.